Hi folks, we're back, continue on with regular training for Robert. Uh, so I uh, want to just say, uh, we continue on this project, and if you haven't subscribed, or you don't just turn into this channel, you can go to the beginning of this exercise, but we're working on a presentation drawing, so please subscribe. Uh, okay, picking up from the last drawing, these are my elevations uh, for presentation. Now I have this view looking realistic, it looks pretty good. For a client, and then this one we can even go here, right click, and activate this view. And then here in the view properties, you just select this and you go realistic. Let's see what that looks like. Okay, so for a drawing like this, you can look at you can do it this way, or you can go and change it to assistant colors. You won't get the real, uh, you do get the brick effect. So either one, you can do that. But there are a few other things you can do here. I want to show you. Uh, let's just leave this realistic for now. I want to deactivate this view. Okay, then we made some. Uh, let's go and set up a sheet, a new sheet, so I can show you how that all works here. So let's go into my project browser. But I have one here already. Okay, that's going to be our floor plan, but it better work with elevation. So we're here, we'll just go right click here and do a new sheet. I have one loaded and I just say okay. Now we want to grab these other two elevations. As you can see, these are blue. That means they're on another sheet, which is a good thing. I want that to scrub on around. So I'll drag and drop this guy here. And basically what I will do, I will change the scale, uh, activate this view, change the scale to quarter inch. So we're going to go over this briefly if I can, because we should know how to crop views and set up drawings. But um, let's do this one. I just want to show you a few things right here. If I can find quarter inch, damn. Sorry. Okay, so I'm going to deactivate that view. Now I want to turn on these... Uh, I'm going to just drag this here, just drag it into the sheet, and then what I want to do, I want to select it, I want to grab these guys here, where's that thing at, uh oh, we fit this here, light bulb, I'm going to deactivate this view, Okay, you know what I'm looking for, right? I'm going to activate this view. There it is. I'm going to turn these guys on, these uh, crop regions. Turn them on and just drag them in here, like so. I mean, you might want to show the trees or something, but we have rendered drawings will be set up for that. So this is kind of all the stuff you might want to do. Uh, and then here, I want to just show you a few extras that you can probably do here with these elevations move that there so there we have that one and I want to also keep cropping here because we don't need to see the bottom of the elevation so I have to make this view crop this up here there there okay now <clears throat> Put it down just a tad bit. You can see the ground. Come on. There you go. Okay. So now we can make this. We can go out and look. Okay. We can do a few other things here. So I'm going to activate this view. But it's already activated good. So I'm going to go into my view templates here. I'm going to create. Here, uh, I'm just going to say no. I don't want to create. I just want to manage for now to see what we got out here. Manage templates. So we have elevations. Uh, we have sections. So we have architecture presentation elevation. Let's try that one. Um, hmm. Let me 
see if I will do this in fine view. It's the temperature take over that, I think. So I'm a little stuck there. But anyway, you can go ahead and add these other sheets here. Uh, that's probably going to be another assignment because that's kind of important. Um, view templates. What I wanted to do, I want to change this to different scripts or different. Um, let me just go drag this on here. This is my West view. Should activate this view at all times, then drag and drop my West view here. So then, you know, we can do a we can do a few things here. Um, these are just for presentation. I can show you a few other things uh, a bit later on here. Um, Up this view here. Change the shell scale. Uh, property scale will be one quarter inch. And there we go. So that's really getting fancy uh, for presentations. In fact, now here we can do to see these trees. So uh, in realistic, we might get away with this. So let me just see what happens here. Okay, realistic. Okay, well we might want to turn the tree off here in this case. So all you would do is just right click, and we'll just uh, hide element because we might want to show one tree hide element there. Okay, so there you go. I'm just getting these laid out for you now. We got our two sheets elevations now. Since we got this extra space on here, I'm going to go back to that other sheet. Um, just do this little thingy here. Come on, guys. So we see it's taking a little more time because of that. So what we do here, we do have some 3D renders view. So here's one here. There's another one. I think for this one, we'll drag and drop that one on this sheet here. I think that's the one. And then we'll, yeah, that's a good one. And then we'll activate the view here. And I hope we can change the scale on this. I think you can. <laughs> or maybe you can't. Okay, so I'm going to do this. I'm going to activate this view. Oh, I can do that though. <laughs> so that's pretty good, guys. So anyway, thanks for watching. I just want to do a continuation of this how to create presentation drawings of your project. So uh, I'm going to leave it there and keep going on this one. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Everybody be safe. Please subscribe. And thank you for watching my video. Everybody, please be safe. And most of all, subscribe. Bye.